Uh, I've taken, out, taken her out for her maiden run, and she's a big hit around town. But I do I did find that I do have some rubbing problems. This tire over here is fine, and I, I made some quick fixes. This was rubbing on the inside right here. It puts a little bit of white paint here that was rubbing just right up in here. What I did was I put two washers under this right here to lift it up a little bit. And then what I did is I came over here and I got a little bit smaller bolt. And I took out the rubber washer and I pulled this up about a quarter of an inch or less. So it doesn't hit right in here. But I don't know how close I got to the um, pipe. But that really, these tires are really nice. I mean, if they were just a half an inch, maybe six or seven millimeters thinner. But they're, they're going to do fine. They rode down the road really great at 25 miles an hour. And that is, uh, let me see how many kilometers that would be. That would be according to this 40 kilometers, 40 kilometers an hour. And my throttle deal is working out pretty good, but I got some slack in it. So I'm going to have to adjust it. I think I'll have to adjust it down at the, down at the uh, uh, carburetor right here. But it's looking really good. It's, it's running well, except for that slight rubbing problem it's it's actually a, a lot more stable with these tires I thought it would be kind of like a four-wheel drive tires you know you get on the road and they go whir, 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 whir. well it's it's running it's working just perfect but I did find out that once you sit on the seat right here that this shock does compress the uh, fender just a little bit into the tire and that's what's causing the rubbing on this other side so I think if I I think if I take my little tool and I go over this one more time and get a little bit more edge off of that I think it's gonna work fine but this is a this is just a fine-tuning process that it takes time to get these new tires and everything to work right but they really look nice. A lot of people, it's a head turner. And it's going to go really good with my Dodge Viper when uh, I get the Viper. You know, some, you can, it's nice to dream. Because uh, it'd just be nice to have something like that. So anyway, I'm going to put it away for the day. I've got a bunch of other work to do. And that's what it looks like complete. I hope you like it. Thank you.